Ladies and gentlemen, I will now request the Vice Chancellor of LAMS, Dr. Adil Najam, to formally open the proceedings. <coughs> Rector of LAMS, our honored guest Shamin Chunoy, faculty, parents, students, ladies and gentlemen. It is my great, great pleasure to welcome you all here and to formally open the 24th annual convocation of the Lahore University of Management. Hold, hold your claps, you will have plenty to clap about today. Today we gather in celebration. Today we gather in this moment of celebration to celebra celebrate the achievements, the pride we have in these wonderful young men and women. Today we gather to celebrate your achievements. Today we gather to celebrate your present. But most of all, today we gather to celebrate your future. Before we celebrate you, however, I would like to request all the graduating students to please stand up. I want, not just yet, not just yet, I would like the undergraduate students here to look towards the middle of the room and I would like the graduate students there to also look towards, please move and look towards the middle of the room. And I would now request you to give your parents, your well-wishers, your fathers, your mothers, your brothers, your sisters, the greatest applause and the greatest thank you that they have ever done. Thank you. Thank you. You may be seated. I think it is a befitting start to the day to begin by celebrating those who have brought you to this moment of celebration. Those who have sat patiently, who have encouraged you, who have prayed for you, who have consoled you, who have given you advice, and in many of the cases have paid your tuition bills. We as LAMS are very thankful to all of you here and we are very thankful for you in the trust that you have given us by leaving with us your most treasured possessions, your children. Thank you, parents. Today, we will have 713 LAMS graduates convocating from this ceremony. That makes this the largest ever convocation for the Lahore University of Management Sciences. Of the 713 that you will hear about and you will see, we have one student who completes today and will be hooded for his, the completion of his Doctor of Philosophy, a PhD. We have we have 225 master students in our various master degrees who will walk. These include the MBA, the Executive MBA, the MSc in Economics, and the Masters of Science in Computer Science and also in Computer Engineering. We will, for the first time in LUMS, award the degrees of the Master of Arts. And our first batch of BA students will walk today and nine of them will be conferred that degree. We will, have, we will have 13 students who will walk today with the degree of a Bachelor of Art LLB. Those 13, as you can see, also shout the loudest. We will have 331 students who will today get their Bachelors of Science with Honours, the BSc Honour Degrees. <laughs> and, 
and we will for the very first time in LUMS history award 134 degrees of bachelors of science in the sciences and engineering. On total, we will therefore have 226 graduate degrees, 487 undergraduate degrees, and a total of 700 degrees, as I said. This is a moment of celebration. This is a moment of joy for all that you have done and all the pride that you have brought for us. This is not the time to go around and tell you all about LUMS. I hope you will have the time as students before you leave here to once again go through the campus and revisit all the wonderful memories you've made here. I hope you will have the time, despite the sun, to take your parents around and show them what has been your home for two years, for four years, and in a few cases for even longer than that. <laughs> Before we move on, I would like to request one other group to please stand up. May I please request my colleagues in the faculty to please all rise. May I ask the students to give them a applause like nothing they have ever heard. Thank you. Thank you. You will carry with you today not just a parchment, not just a degree, but also the hopes and aspirations of your parents. And also, in each one of you, you will carry a piece of each one of them. Keep it with dignity, hold it with pride, because forever you will be part of us. And forever, whether you like it or not, we will be a part of you. This is the 24th convocation of LUMS. We are now an old and prestigious institution, more than a quarter century old. This year we graduate our largest class. I wanted to give just a few other numbers before we start with the formal proceedings. This is an institution which is today not only larger, but different in many ways from the institution it had started off as. But in every way, it holds all the aspirations that it had started with. This year, we had upwards of 3,200 students on campus. This year, 40% of our students, one out of every three, was given some form of financial aid by LUMS. This year, the Lahore University of Management Sciences gave out a total amount of financial assistance to our students worth 340 million. I say those numbers not to wow you, not to impress you, but to reiterate a commitment that this university has always had to be a university of excellence, not for some Pakistanis, but for all Pakistanis. We have had students, not just from every province, but nearly from every district in this country. We have had students from one corner of the country to the other, from the west and the east and the north and the south. And we are thankful to have all those students, because each one of you, in your own particular way, has made this institution a better place than it would have been without you being here. For that, we thank you. Ten percent of our students are in a program that we call the National Outreach Program. And I do not, I, did, I wondered whether I should tell the story or not, but a number of my colleagues asked me to, and therefore I will, because it pleases my heart, and I hope it will please your heart too. NOP students are students in the greatest economic need, who come in on their own merit. They are here not because they are in need, they are here because they are smart and they are bright and they are as good as any Pakistan. We are extremely proud of all our students. And the story I wanted to tell you happened 
eight days ago. As some of you might have noticed, I walk around a lot on campus, and I was walking with my wife and one of our security guards, NOP students. One of our security guards came running to me with a smile as wide as this room. And he came up to me and he said, my daughter has just been admitted to the NOP program. I tell this story. I tell this story to celebrate his success. I tell this story to celebrate her success. But most of all, I tell this story to celebrate our success and to celebrate your success. And the success here is not that his daughter got admitted to the NOP program. The success here is that every Pakistani, no matter where, no matter what, if they are smart, if they are bright, if they are hardworking, has the right to dream big, to aspire big, and to achieve the dreams and aspirations. And that is what we are here to celebrate. Thank you once again. <laughs>